Let me mention one other cause which is controversial but consistent with my faith and principles. And more importantly, consistent with this country's founding principles and its constitution. I believe that every Minnesotan should have the freedom to marry legally the person she or he loves, whether of the same or other sex. Last year, Minnesotans began a conversation about why marriage matters. And we found our common belief that it is about love, commitment, and responsibility. I want Minnesota to be a state which affirms that freedom, that freedom for one means freedom for everyone, and where no one is told it is illegal to marry the person you love. Surprised that gay marriage came up in the state of the state. Uh, not necessarily. We had heard that that potentially was the case, but uh, you, know, you know, I'm not sure that, that now is exactly uh, the time to be talking about that. I know uh, this is a, an issue that certainly the, the state of Minnesota is divided on, and one of the things that a lot of us have commented on uh, in St. Paul is that we need to have uh, a, little, a little more cooperation and working together, and I think that uh, we really need to be focused on the budget and, and growing the economy and creating jobs. We feel that that's what is good for all Minnesotans, and that's what, what all Minnesotans can agree is, is what we should be working on in St. Paul. So we hope we can work together on, on those things and really make that our number one priority. I know out on the campaign trail, everybody says that, that what we need to do is, is grow the economy and create jobs. Here's our opportunity. And, and, and we're, as I said earlier, uh, ready to roll up our sleeves and get to work to do that. Mr. Senator Ham, would you comment on that also? Well, I agree with Representative Dowd. I think uh, we had a pretty robust debate about that in the last election, and uh, I think uh, uh, we need to focus on the budget. We need to focus on creating jobs, uh, and that's what we're here to do. You were accused by Democrats two year, for two years of overreaching when you guys had the majority, particularly because of what they said were divisive social issues. Is that happening here? Well, we'll see. Uh, I think. You don't uh, well, I think that uh, it certainly is an issue that has divided the people of the state of Minnesota. There's lots of very passionate opinions on this on both sides, and uh, the uh, majority certainly has the opportunity to uh, bring whatever the issue they want to the floor. But we think that the budget, we think that uh, how we are going to deal with the economy are the important issues, the central issues. We think the governor's approach is the wrong way to do it. We think that we have a, uh, some suggestions and are willing to work on it in a better way, so we'll see. Is this an overreach? Uh, well, we'll see what they do. I don't understand what that means. What do you mean? They're, they're, in, they're in charge. They're, they're in charge. I guess that they, they're either going to do it or not. So well, if they I do it, is it an overreach? Yeah. Well, we'll see. I, we'll see what they do. Why are you so sensitive to talk about the gay marriage issue? Do you support? Personally? Yes, sir. Uh, well, I think you know I, I voted in favor of the amendment, and uh, so I, you know my feelings on it, and uh, I'm not in charge of what the majority does. So I think that the issue uh, has been a debate that we've had in the state. We currently have it as the statute, the state law. I think uh, the attempt to change state law, uh, as I understand the debate we had on the amendment, that was not the issue in the amendment. I think uh, uh, reading the debate we had on the amendment issue and saying that that's an endorsement to change state law. I'm not sure I would read it that way. If the majority reads it that way, then we'll see what they do. Is Minnesota ready uh, for legal gay marriage, uh, Representative Dow? You know, I don't, I don't think that, that question necessarily is up to me. And, and as I said... Well, you're, you're the leader of the Republicans. Sure, sure. So. Uh, you know, as I said earlier, uh, I, th I think that we can see from from the results of the election that uh, that this is an issue that does divide Minnesota. And and frankly, we, our priority is to work on issues that we think all Minnesotans care about and, and, and want us to tackle here at the Capitol. And we know that that's growing the economy and creating jobs. So that's our commitment.